you need someone who's going to win, I would recommend Jake. Jake. Jake! You're going! The water's coming in. It'll fill up pretty quickly. Celebrities, tonight you will all be going head to head in the battle for immunity. We will survive! We will never surrender! ends tonight. Two teams are ready to give their all. But only the strongest will survive. Here on I'm a Celebrity. Get me out of here! Tonight, the Wombats and the Galars go head to head in one last battle for the greatest prize of them all. One million pounds. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you mean, Jellybean? It's, yeah. not, it's not that, is it? It's not that. I'm talking about immunity. That's the greatest prize of them all. Not a million pounds. No. Because it does sound quite a lot better. <laughs> but if you say so. Also, coming up on tonight's show, Foggy and Jake get tanked, Edwina channels Churchill, and there's another bumper batch of bad Do you know what? I rue the day we ever met, you talentless moron. What? Nothing, just banter. Banter! banter. banter. Great banter. Banter. Just banter! Let's go back to yesterday morning now, when the Galahs woke up struggling with their hangovers. You can talk, you're an absolute disgrace when you've had a drink. No wonder you've never had any real friends. <laughs> Classic banter. What? Jimmy didn't wake up very buoyant this morning. Maybe he's ran out of banter. He didn't wake everyone up and he was quite chilled out and quite quiet. Okay, so what did it look like? Okay, so what did it look like? I decided for everyone to have a lay-in in camp this morning because it is the coldest night and the coldest morning that we've been here. Because I've woken up every morning since I've been here. They get one lay-in a week. Edwina Curry. How are you, girl? Aching all over. Are you really? Had a hard day yesterday, mate. Yes, but I'm okay. I really shouldn't have had that wine last night. I don't feel great. We won the challenge yesterday, so we had wine with dinner last night. Feeling a little bit fragile this morning, maybe a little bit groggy and hungover. Good morning, V. Good morning, Michael. How are you after our past? Well, a bit hungover. I did have my So much. So much. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Was yeah. she drunk? Nah. It was one of those sort of uh, bottles you get on airlines. It went very, very swiftly down my throat and in my stomach, and it was gone. Uh, it, it, it was very nice while it lasted, which was about 35 seconds, I think. Kendra! Come on, girl, wake up! Kendra got rude awakening this morning. She came in last night and woke us all up. Kendra! Come on, Ken. Can't wake us up and expect it not to be woken. You, get up now! Karma definitely bit me in my ass this morning. You all right? Morning. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, too. You good, man? Thank you. Foggy? Morning, mate. How are you? Good to see you, pal. Welcome to the Bush Tucker Trial Clearing. Okay. Head-to-head challenge today. Foggy, you were you were in the challenge yesterday and you're back today. Why is that? I'm meant to be the strongest. We didn't go about right well, you said. We're both two strongest ones physically, I think, in camp and... I think it's going to be quite physical today, I'm guessing. Yeah, it's a good battle, this. Right, it's right. a good battle. Do you want to see what you're against? Yeah, let's do it. All right. This is down the chain. You're both going to be shackled inside these identical tanks. When the trial starts, the tanks will fill with water and you need to undo the padlocks as quickly as you can using the four keys that you'll find in the four mazes in your tanks. 
Then once your hands and feet are free, you need to find the five red keys that are somewhere on the floor of the tanks. Then using those five red keys, you have to get up and unlock the hatch. You unlock those five padlocks and the first person to get out and ring their bell will be the winner and will win a meal for every member of their tribe. Right. It's as straightforward as that. Now this is much tougher trial, so you won't be alone. Oh really? In the tank. You can go. <laughs> yeah, not quite us. Well, yeah. No, we're not. I don't fancy us with this. So what do you reckon, guys? You know yeah. what it is. It's head to head. It's going to be a good battle. This. Oh, yeah. You fancy giving it a go? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. You up for it? Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, this is going to be good. It's going to be good. Yeah. Put your body on. Let's get you ready. Let's get you in position. Go. Cool. Are you both ready? Yeah. Yeah. You can start when you hear the klaxon. Good luck. Coming up, Jake and Foggy fight it out. Two champions going in the battle, isn't really it? Is. And the tribes prepare to go head to head. Come on, Wallabies! We will survive! Yeah, we're not Wallabies, though. We're Wallabies! Because... Welcome back to I'm a Celebrity Get Me Out of Here. Before the break, we saw Jake and Foggy prepare to face the latest trial down the chain. Now, as with all the Bush Tucker trials, we really have to stress. Uh, please don't try this at home. Mind you, what kind of weirdo would have chains and manacles and leather restraints lying around their house? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean. sure. What kind of weirdo would have that kind of stuff hidden under the bed in the spare room? <laughs> Run the VT! <laughs> Are you both ready? Yeah. yeah. Just to clarify, you've got to get the keys out of the mazes first so you can free your arms and your legs. Then you can go down on the floor for the red keys. Okay. 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 One red key at a time, one lock at a time. You can start when you hear the klaxon. Good luck. And you're off. So first they have to get the keys out of the mazes to release their arms and legs. Right, the water's coming in. It'll fill up pretty quickly. They've got different tactics. Jake started low, Foggy started high. Ah, well done, Foggy's got his first key there. He's got his wrist shackle off. Jake's released his leg. Both of them onto the second maze now. Second key. That's Jake's second key there. Foggy's got an arm and a leg free now. Both onto their third maze now. It's neck and neck. as well. Both of them onto the final maze now. This is where Foggy might regret not starting at the bottom. Two champions going to the bottom, isn't it? He's got it, that's his fourth key, one of the hatches now. There's five red keys at the bottom, Jake needs to get them and release the hatch. He's struggling down there now, now that the water's risen. He is. Jake needs to work out which key fits which padlock on the hatch. Dropped it. Uh. 
seconds to get the lock. He's really struggling, still on his fourth miss. Third padlock down for Jake, he's steaming ahead. He's finally finished his last maze, but Jake's only got one more padlock to go. He's done it, yes! He's done it, ring the bell! There we go! Come on! Oh, he's done it! He's done it, well done, Jake! All right, Foggy! Yeah, it's lazy. I'm a bit scared. 